Hey, BG Radio here with Oxygen Not Included from Clay Entertainment. This is just a quick look at one of my biggest colonies so far. I picked up the game earlier this week. It left uh, Alpha and went to Early Access. I'm going to start, let them do their thing. So I've got eight duplicates here. That's what the little guys are called. There's Rachel, Rachel Ray. She's the cook. She's got dirty hands and is grimy. Um, but basically, there's this printing pod here, and it sends duplicates into the area that you start the game. You can build a number of things for your base. Apparently, I can build a pneumatic door now by doing some research. And kind of like Don't Starve, where the goal is to craft a bunch of things so that you can get food and survive. In this game, it's all about that plus oxygen here. Breathable gas. Um, let me put this overlay up. So the lighter blue it is, the better the breathing is. As you can see over here, unbreathable for some reason. I have no idea. It's really close to my starting area. I had to deal with this a whole lot. Um, people would run into this area, as you can see, if I zoom in real quick. Yeah, they're having trouble breathing. They're making like they're holding their breath face. Uh, so let me build something quick, real quick, just to kind of illustrate. So there's an oxygen tab down here, base oxygen power, etc. And with oxygen, you can build these deoxinizers, throw some algae in there, and algae is like this right here in the ground. There's algae, sandstone, uh, sand, something should just be dirt somewhere. Fertilizer for some reason. And you just take from the environment and you build stuff. Well, I can pause the game again real quick and kind of address some of the stuff on the upper left. I have three buildings that are lacking resources. It's these two things. These are my algae deoxinizers. They are hooked up to a power source powered by my wife, Ashley, here, who is running in a manual generator. Um, this uh, is also sending any kind of extra power, overloaded power, into these batteries. Um, these aren't running not because they don't have enough power, but because they don't have enough algae. I need to do some digging. This is algae, but I've got a pot on top of it. So I've started kind of expanding upward and expanding downward here just to try to get away. And let me show you the environment here. There's say there's some igneous rock and some obsidian, some granite down here, some abyss <laughs> is that abyssal light? <laughs> I have no idea what that's used for yet. But there's some areas on the outskirts of where I started that aren't as friendly as the innards. There's this polluted water, polluted oxygen area. Right here, there is a, uh, there's oxygen, there's some hydrogen. Right here, it's a vacuum. Why? I don't know. It's sealed up. Um, other areas are sealed up. Like, this is also a vacuum, but this, oh, there's water in here. And yeah, water, there's liquids. So there's polluted water, and there's water. I haven't found anything else like lava or sludge, whatever you want to call it. Uh, I just recently made this liquid pump, got it working, I had my tubes all messed up. It's pumping water, let me turn it back on, so it's, this, these pipes are full of water that aren't doing anything, but there's a shower. And no one has used the shower yet, but if I hover over people, I, it's easier if I pause. I, have, I have hover over Rick, of Rick and Morty fame, I just think, let me see his face here. I think he looks like Rick. <laughs> Lil Rick! <laughs> He's got dirty hands and he's grimy, and if I hover or select him, grimy means he's dirty and needs a shower. However, he's also a physician, but no one's taking a shower. And I can't seem to do anything about that. Let me see, Rick is delivering something, but I wonder if I can... Let me just track him with the camera. It's a little jerky <laughs> right now, but we can kind of follow Rick and see what he's up to. So Rick's going way down. Oh, he just uh, leveled up his athletics probably. Yeah, so the more they move, the more their athletics go up. And you can look at his vitals until Rick's not hungry at all. But he also hasn't eaten today. Like, only two people have eaten. And Rachel, Rachel Ray, the chef here, has eaten a lot. <laughs> so Rick's doing a bunch of stuff. And I can kind of give him some direction. Let's see if I can get him to take a shower. And I know it's a little lewd for a kind of quick look at what I'm doing. But I'm going to see if I can send him. I don't know if that sends him to the shower. No, it didn't. It just selected the shower. 
So I guess maybe they'll maybe he takes a shower when he wants to. And I'm just trying to looking. I'm kind of looking and seeing if there's anything that will stop him from taking a shower. He's uncultured. He's very destructive. Um, there is combat in this game, but unfortunately, you won't see much of it in this run. Uh, there's only been one fight so far. It really did a number on my wife, who survived. But I built this cot once I got Rick, and I made her go there, and now she's all healed up again. So there's just a lot of stuff that I'm still kind of learning. I built a space heater over here because I kept complaining about being cold. Uh, I put it by the beds, and unfortunately, if I show the overlay again, you can see there's a bit of carbon dioxide seeping over here. So Josh Lee of joshlee.com fame, this is his bed, <laughs> and he like two nights in a row, two, three nights in a row, would wake up in the middle of the night because he couldn't breathe, which I was just for certain sure he was going to just suffocate in his sleep and be our first casualty, but he's he's a damn trooper, and I love his face wherever he is. is that's Ripley. Um, where is Josh Lee? It's kind of hard to tell where people are sometimes. Oh, is this? No, that's, that's Ripley again. Interesting. So Josh Lee is... He's not, he didn't die on me, and I didn't realize it, did he? <laughs> I'm like, he's the one of the darkest people here. Let's mm, uh, not move to, oh crap. Uh, let's follow, jo oh, Josh Lee is cooking. That's why I couldn't see him. He's, he's the cook for some reason. He's also the center of attention. His cooking just went up. So right now, we're making some really garbage food. It's a mush bar. It's made from dirt and water. Why they won't? I can't. I haven't found a way to make them automatically refrigerate, or not, I can't refrigerate yet. But put the food up. Okay, I got Klepik to do it. Um, I don't think I can make a refrigerator yet. So you, you research things. I need fine dining, and right now I've I kind of got away from myself because there's so much to explain here in a little bit of time I'm taking to do so. I can make a refrigerator, which will kind of increase the shelf life. I've had a lot of food lately going bad. Ripley has is tired for some reason and also, I think, has a problem. Yeah, it's a narcoleptic nap. He just falls asleep and someone else does it too. I think Lacey... She's wet because I put this ladder into the water. They don't like that. But I had a point to it. Anyway, so research. Let me open up the research bar or the research screen here. So I've researched almost everything from the far left category. I, I can do farming, liquid piping so I can make that shower, power regulation so I can t make switches to turn the power on and off. Haven't done that yet, but I can make a bigger battery, which I have done. And some interior decor. Haven't done that yet. I can make a sculpting block, a pneumatic door. You, they can draw art, but I'm not really concerned about that because I'm trying to keep them alive and breathing at the moment. So... I went into some fine dining and some sanitation. So fine dining, I want to get finished because that allows me to make a cooking station, which makes better food. Uh, although we have very low resources and not a lot of wildlife that we've been killing. But the refrigerator. So I'm going to switch back to fine dining and get them going again. And Cole, <laughs> who might appreciate how he looks, I got a lot of dark skinned people, which no problem with that for me, but I'm like, when I'm naming them after people, I couldn't customize what they look like, so I would have probably been more selective with trying to make people true to form, but hey, Cole, accept it. You are a dark-skinned man with orange hair and you're balding on the sides. <laughs> you're beautiful. It also makes you easy to find. <laughs> more so than Josh Lee, who has his back to me right here. I don't know his butt yet. So I'm, I'm really enjoying it. I've don't know if I can tell how, many, how much time I've put into it. The game overall, I could probably look at to see real quick. Oh, so, so there, there are cycles. There's day-night cycles when the planet or the, the body here kind of goes into the dark zone. That's the sleep time. Uh, you want everyone to have a bed. Oh, my wife needs to go to the bathroom, so I guess she hit her... Wait, yeah, she must have hit her bed and then had to go poo-poo. Um, I need to clean this toilet. This one's fine. Once it kind of gets to like half of its visits remaining, someone needs to clean it. So you can speed up the time, 
get through the night or other stuff. So as you can see, I don't you don't really spend a lot of your time directly controlling people. You more or less say what you want to happen and the most control you can give them is going up to the jobs where you could say oh my I man I, I had this taken care of my insufficient oxygen generation so it must be just because I'm out of algae so I'm gonna have to do a pause real quick just so I can talk about this screen I've started getting a little bit more selective there are cases where people just refuse to do what you want them to so Rick as you can see here he won't fight he won't do art he won't repair anything but the redder something is the more color in there the better their skills are so there are cases where like with digging I might say go ahead and dig even though you're not really good at it just so someone will do it but I'm trying to be a little bit more aware of like Cole's good at a lot of stuff and that wasn't always the case like some of the stuff he let's find like some of these things are threes and that's because he's just been doing them and getting better at it construction is a two like some of these people started with like zero or one in something and I just had them do things just to get better at them because you start with three duplicates and when there's only three people it's really hard to say you're going to do this, you're going to do this, and you're going to do this and you won't do anything else because you need them doing everything to start. So the starting people kind of have the worst situation because they have to do everything but as you add a new person every few cycles I kind of accommodate based on their skills so it's nice to be at 8 I'm hoping I make it to 10 and just kind of keep on going it's it's very I don't know the average speed I guess of a player of oxygen not included how decorative do people get in the beginning I'm very much like a functional person so I just want them to survive and to be able to keep going I pick a goal and I kind of stick with it which is a little tough I pause the game a lot I do want to get to the point where we can have refrigerated food and we can cook something better than these gross mush bars, but uh, someone here is my cook. Let me look real quick. I know Josh was cooking and he's like all right at it, but yeah, Rachel, of course. Rachel Ray is the cook, wherever she is. Clean that toilet, Lacey. There's Rachel. She... I'm not sure what she's doing. Oh, she's getting some items out of this storage. So, yeah, you can store all of your materials. Uh, Klepik looks a little tired. A lot of my storage containers appear to be full. Which, maybe I should make some new ones. So I'll go ahead and set that up. And here's kind of a quick look at how I do building. You put two things down. You can go to this prioritize menu. Everything starts at a five. 5 priority is like right in the middle it's not it's not the lowest or the highest slam a 9 on that thing and say build this as soon as you can let's see if Klepik accommodates my request here nope he says screw you um, I'm trying to think of a few more things I want to talk about I learned in another game food decayed that kind of sucks but I'll get a refrigerator soon <laughs> Is anyone doing research? Oh, Cole. Cole's the supercomputer man. He's doing some research for me. Whoa. The research is complete. Great. So, we completed fine dining. I can make a refrigerator. Uh, the thing I was going to say was... Ashley fell asleep at the top of the ladder. I learned in a different game, a different build, that water can leak through weak containers so like this is a good pool of water but if I started getting rid of the like the dirt the foundation around it you'll see a little animation of leaking happening and I was like in my head thinking this is great you know to have something leak like that was that's a cool detail little did I know it was actual real functional you know it's conveying that this won't last much longer and I flooded my starting area only like ankle high, I had to have everyone clean it up, and I had to fill in the hole where the water was pouring in, but it, it really caught me by surprise, I thought it was funny, a great detail, I'm really interested because of stuff like that, and where's, where Clay is going to go with this game as they add more features and get out of uh, early access, but I'm really liking it so far, just, just seeing what you can do, right, 
it hasn't been too hard considering I had like no idea really how to play the game. There's a little bit of a tutorial when you start, but I really like it. Why they're all up here? I guess because I put these containers and they built them. They really, oh uh, yeah, they're high priority. <laughs> they don't need to be. <laughs> So you kind of got to tell everyone, calm, calm the hell down. So what's the next thing I should research here? Just real quick. Percolation? Filters carbon dioxide and moves it out of the air. That's a great thing because I got a bunch of it. So that's cool. Um, let's see if I can build a refrigerator real quick. I will put the refrigerator right here. Um, Build a no go to power plug it in prioritize that at a nine and then we'll see what happens. So I I kind of like these games. Uh, Verdian noticed me kind of getting back into Fallout Shelter for a little bit. I haven't touched that game in a while, but I kind of like the games where you're playing them but you can kind of step back and just look at what's going on. This is a little bit more of a game, I'd say, than Fallout Shelter. You really have to be on top of stuff or it can really fall apart. But there are times where you are free to just kind of sit back and watch all your duplicates just run around and take care of all the tasks in front of you. And... Yeah, it looks like it starts automatically saying I can put food. So I don't know if I can actually move my food between... Like, if I have food that's not refrigerated, can I move it? I'm not sure. I hope they kind of just get a little smarter about that, but let's take a look at how I'm doing. So, yeah, we're getting kind of carbon dioxide -y over here. But, oh, did they not build that yet? Oh, I guess I didn't prioritize it? No, I didn't. Okay. So I think I'm researching, right? Uh, Lacey's researching how to percolate, which will remove the... Produces a steady supply of oxygen using piped in water. That's pretty cool. Oh, my refinement. Uh, fertilizer maker uses polluted water to produce fertilizer. Um, fertilizer, I think, is, it might be a new part of the game going to early access. There's an agriculture update. I... Haven't really been doing a lot of farming. Is this producing bad air? I'm not sure. I'm really confused. Like, when bubbles come out, that's good. That's oxygen. But this thing is, like, pooping. And I can't tell if that's... I can't tell. I mean, it seems bad. But I'm not sure... More food has decayed. Oh, crap. Okay, so... Look at this. So I'm glad it tells you buildings are lacking resources, but as you can see, it's... I am just low on algae. And there's some algae right here, but... It's kind of in my... Foundation. Slime. So I, I can do a bit of a look around, a look-see, if you will, and say, hey, there's some algae here. There's a bit of oxygen, but then there's some hydrogen. But... I think I'm going to go for that next. I can create an airlock. It creates an airtight seal that maintains the atmosphere and pressure between areas. I might have to find a way to get this algae without releasing the hydrogen. Because <laughs> that's not breathable and that would suck. So I am going to... I think just start trying to dig like that and then do a little bit of this. Throw a nine on that sucker. And build another storage container. But also throw a nine on that sucker. And see what kind of happens. So, uh,. That's pretty much my take on how this game goes. You really gotta... There's a lot you you gotta pay attention to. Let's see, is there actual food in here? Are they putting food in the refrigerator? 
They might not be. It's hard to tell. <laughs> I can make a better toilet too, but I haven't done that yet. Uh, she went into the water. They they really hate that and they keep on doing it. <laughs> That's fine. I don't know how long they stay wet. She's still wet. Oh, and they're digging down there too. So yeah, I really like this game. I'm having a lot of fun with it. Uh, I was curious if I tried to make a video if something would go wrong. I'm not producing as much oxygen as I would like to be doing, which I'm going to really have to deal with immediately. <laughs> but I'm working on it. I'm working on it. All right, I'm BG Radio with Horrible Night. Uh, I hope to follow up on this when it leaves early access and kind of see what's what it's up to. I'm still feeling the same way about it then, but you know, I'll catch you next time with another game curious or plus. Salute. <laughs> Keep breathing. <laughs>